Let's consider this problem. The following propositional statement is P implies Q or R implies P and Q implies R. Is it satisfiable but not valid? Is it valid? Is it a contradiction? Or is it none of the above? This question has been asked in GATE 2004 for two marks. We can solve this question with the same idea that we adopted in solve problem number three. Here you can see in this compound preposition, there are three propositional variables P, Q and R. We need to choose some truth value combination of P, Q and R in such a way that we would be able to make this compound preposition false so that we would be able to prove that this compound preposition is not valid, right? And we would straight away eliminate this option. And if we would not be able to make this compound preposition false, then definitely this compound preposition is valid, right? And we cannot stop here because if it is not valid, it may be satisfiable or it may be a contradiction. Hence, we need to go one step further. We would try to make this compound preposition true for at least one truth value combination of P, Q and R. And then we can say that this compound preposition is true for that particular combination. If we would be able to make it true, then we can say option A is correct. And if we would not be able to make this compound preposition true using any combination of P, Q and R, then we can conclude that option C is the correct one, right? Let's try to solve this question. P implies Q or R implies P and Q implies R. Now, let's try to make this compound proposition false by taking some truth value combination of P, Q and R. As we want to make this compound proposition false and this one true so that we would be able to make this compound proposition false finally. So we take P value true and Q value true and R false, right? Then this whole compound proposition becomes false. Okay. Now, as we already chose the truth values of P, Q and R, let's plug them in into this particular compound proposition as well. P is true, Q is true, and R is false. As true or false is true finally, and true implies true is true. Now finally true implies false is false, right? As we would be able to make this compound proposition false by taking one truth value combination of P, Q and R, hence we can say that it is not valid. This option is straight away eliminated, right? Let's try to make it satisfiable. If we are successful in making this compound proposition true for at least one truth value combination of P, Q and R, then we can say that it is satisfiable, right? And it is not a contradiction. So let's try to make this compound proposition true. Let me rewrite this compound proposition for you here. Let's take P false. When P is false, it doesn't matter what will be the truth value of Q. This whole compound proposition becomes false only. Let's take Q true. Then this compound proposition becomes false. And we know that false implies anything is always true, right? So let's take R true. And we finally know that this whole compound proposition becomes true. Okay. As P is false, Q is true and R is true, let's plug in these values inside this compound proposition as well. Q is true, R is true, P is false. We know that false implies anything is true only. Therefore, this compound proposition is true only. Now, finally, true implies true is true. Right? So, what is the final result? As we are successful in making this compound proposition true for at least one truth value combination of P, Q and R and hence we can say it is satisfiable but not valid. Contradiction is straight away eliminated. If we would not be able to make this compound proposition true for any truth value combination then we can say that this option is correct. But we are successful in making this compound proposition true for at least one truth value combination and hence we can say that it is satisfiable but not valid.